movie time. Yeah, I'm a Raider, Oakland Raider. From the Bay to LA to Las Vegas. I'm a player, a boss player. If you with me, pop your collar, shake them haters. I'm a Raider, Oakland Raider. From the Bay to LA to Las Vegas. I'm a player, a boss player. If you with me, pop your collar, shake them haters. I'm from the city of set, rep is silver and black. Word of hot show, give me the strap. The realest is back. Stupid chop with some silly attach. I for a nah, fuck it, man, give me a patch. I'm a Raider, Oakland, LA, Vegas, Jalen, Kenyon, Jacobs, Vegas. Man, bread, do we litty litty? The shine with the speed, it was with the 50 50. Yeah, they said I still been Blackfield. Abram in the box, American in the backfield. Yo, so I gotta start the show with this real quick, right? So I'm trying to get my voice back. You know what I mean? I got my medicine you still, ball. You still haven't updated that bitch yet, huh? Yeah, I, I got my medicine ball. You know what I mean? And I got hey, some... whoa, whoa, whoa. We don't give a fuck about that. You ain't updated that video yet, bro. <laughs> it, it, fuck you, Stu. And I got fuck this you. I got this broth, right? I didn't know that's what we're calling that nowadays. <laughs> I got this broth. <laughs> and, Stu, and Stu tells me, but that's cum, bitch. Yeah. Bye bye, bro. That was funny, bro. It was like right before we started the show. He said, I got my beer, I got my medicine ball, I got my broth. That oh, shit was fucking comedy, bro. Oh my, my god. Like fucking jizz, because I'm, you know. <laughs> oh, bro, I can't wait to see you, motherfuckers, man. There's going to be some shit talking going down this weekend. Real hey, quick. my boy, hey, dude, uh, I'm finally excited for it because there's been so much, so much, so much, so much family stuff i've had this my daughter's birthday my son's first soccer game my daughter's first volleyball game and just the right. trip planning the trip and but i was talking with my buddy pat who's gonna come and dude he's pumped the the i already booked the flights uh free it's it's gonna be all you can drink on the plane dude <laughs> like and the cool thing is we're gonna be lit I was flying from indianapolis to dallas where i am so me and my wife are going to be flying on the same flight in that three show. hours. And it's going to probably turn into fucking soul plane too. If that, if that, that bitch is going to go missing like flight uh, M1480 or whatever. That bitch is going to be just come up missing. Still talking all that shit. He's going to get on there and get nervous as fuck. Like, <laughs> no, it'll be on the way home. It's the way home that I'm right. Be, uh, yeah. Right, yeah. right, right. I, after the long weekend of fucking... Of drinking and having but, fun. But I got food. I got my boy Pat, and then on the way from again from Adelanto to Dallas, it'll be Docs and Tiff. So yeah, yeah right. Thanks. Real quick, you guys, shout out to my brother Mitchell Renz, man. He had way one too many drinks today on his live. So um, this hey, live, wait, was hey, don't be putting him on blast like oh, that. No, no, no. I, I don't get, look, I don't give a fuck. Look, and Mitch knows <laughs> this. Um, he was fucked up on his live. Your liquor, motherfucker. Bro, shit. Hey, bro, bro, Mitch. I was gonna say you. I was gonna say you motherfuckers are gonna be fucked up before I even call, get to LA. If you guys are drinking on the plane call, ride. Call his ass the fuck out, man. Hey, handle your shit, Mitch. Hey, look, look, look. <laughs> Mitch texted me and every word was spelled wrong, and I said, "Oh, this ain't." This He's ain't gonna right. have a rough Saturday, bro. When he meets me, then <laughs> I'm a fucking dump. His ass is gonna be puking <laughs> on his fucking thing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, real quick, man. Shout out to Auntie6 Doc Stu Brandon. What up, man? Can't wait. We were to talking run. about you earlier, huh? We were me yeah. and Docs were talking about you earlier, bro. We got a job for you on Saturday. Yep, we got a job for you, bro. We we we, we need you to get to work, man. Hey, yep. man, come, come holla at us, man. Uh me, we're all gonna be actually in Adelanto tomorrow. I fly in, Stu flies, and we'll be there about 12 and 12 o'clock in the afternoon. I think so, yeah. Brandon's yeah. Uh, driving out from Saturday. Say, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm driving down from sex. So I got I, I gotta get cut, you know what I mean? I gotta be on I know work. I I, I bro, need to get... oh, you looking rough, bro. You looking rough right now. <laughs> you talking about? I look good no matter what. Bro. You definitely look like some like somebody's Uncle Ted. Like you look like, like <laughs> Uncle, Uncle Theodore. Ted. Uncle Theodore. Let me see. <laughs> bitch said on his live, eat these do, Darian Butler will get cut. Now, I can't wait to meet you, motherfucker, or see you guys again, dude. It's gonna yeah. be it's gonna be fucking so much fun, bro, man. It's, it's gonna be fun, dog. We've already gonna, been drinking a lot, bro. I haven't. I haven't. I haven't drank. 
bro. I haven't drank or done anything in a fucking in a week, dude. I'm I'm yeah, fucking also uh, so you know, <laughs> fucked up because you're too sober. What? You no, know you're too sober. Right now I am, yeah. Hey, he he said in a week like that was a long time though. <laughs> hey, y'all hey, go a week with no impurities in your body. I'm fucking with you, bro. I'm fucking. No, I'm with just you. saying it, that's like you know that clean the system out, man. Hey, no, yeah, cop, no cop. Plus, I had, to, I had to pass a drug test, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Oh, shit. <laughs> hey, real quick, brave. Hey, hey B, bro. wait, hold on, B. Why, why you keep apologizing and shit, bro? Like, what the fuck is up with that shit? Oh, hey, bro, sorry, I'm bro. Just, I'm just kidding, Stu. Like, I'm just fucking with you, dog. Just hey. like this night right now. Stop Cause I, cause I know you be getting butt hurt, bro. You be getting butt hurt sometimes, dog. That's hey, hey Stu, hey, Stu, who's that remind you of? Who's that remind you of? Damn it. I we're uh Captain Jack. Yes, yeah, yeah, yes, 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 yeah, yeah. I'm like, motherfucker, stop saying sorry, man. Shout out to our yeah. shout out to our big bro, Captain Jack, man. Um, shout out to everybody here in the chat as well. If you guys don't got your ticket yet, man, what are you waiting for? Saturday is the biggest Raider event of the year, week zero in Atalanto. California in the high desert. It's only ten dollars, you guys. I know the link is going to be all up and down the other uh, comments. Section. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. I just finished my video too. Um, but here's what I said at the end of it. If y'all don't make it, here we go. Listen to this. Nation, part of the nation. You got to be there. Otherwise, call yourself a Kansas City Chiefs fan, and I'm out. Yep. Talk right. that shit. Right. Go to hey, yeah. Go go fuck with the Chiefs fans, then if you don't want to show up for this, man. You know what I'm saying, like. Right. 100%. 100%. What's start going wearing, on with y'all, man? Fucking, start wearing a fucking George Karloftis jersey and something, man, because you ain't no Raider Nation if you ain't coming to this motherfucker. Right. Bro, hey, this shit is hilarious, bro. Hey, I watched your interview with Too Short. That was dope. Oh, appreciate it, man. We, you, I had to do it on the fly. You know, you know, you know, but it was it was smooth, man. It was, it was. <laughs> it was what it was. I do have a little bro. gripe, though. I do have a little gripe, dog. What's the gripe? Like, yo, Too Short, man, hey. How do you feel about coming and kicking it with some Raiders, Warren Sapp, and others? Yo, you can't give me a name shout out, bro. What oh, the oh, fuck? Oh, hey, hey, so you know what's funny? Look at your phone. I texted you right before that. I called you right before that, right? He was yeah. probably trying to get you on live, dog. Dude, no, he wasn't. Look he at your phone. Was. Look, bro, was. look at your phone. I don't want to hear that shit, man. I'm just saying, hey, I, hey, I, hey, I hey, you hey, can't hey, say, yo, are you excited to see Warren right Sapp and Stu That's Swagger? legendary right there. <laughs> what? I said, this profile picture on Rosa right here. That's I hope legendary. that's not really her. That's, <laughs> that's, hey, that's, that's a whole lot of glizzies, man. Actually, today, <laughs> I, today, for the first time, I watched from start to finish The Exorcist. I never watched that thing from start to finish. That's crazy. Pretty good. It just reminds me of when she was fucking saying, you know, puking and all that shit, that hot dog picture there. <laughs> fuck me. Fuck me. <laughs> oh, my God, bro. Be one of those shows out. tonight, y'all. It's going to be one of them shows tonight. Shout out oh, to Hard Conversations. God. Graphic, I have a question for Stu. What stadium had the rowdiest fans? Oakland, L.A.? I've never played in L.A. or Vegas. It's Oakland. I mean, what, 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 what's considered rowdy now? Shooting people and stabbing people? Oakland, yeah. But hey, as far as – Hold on, hold on. Did you guys see at the A's game, dude was getting some head up top uh, – uh, up top. Uh, by what, like, in, in the nosebleeds or something? Bro, he was in the nosebleeds getting dome piece, bro. I swear. Like, that shit went that shit went viral. They're trying to find dude. He was up there getting tippy top, man. That's yeah, funny. well, they needed that, – that's, that's lame. Whoa, 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 hey, whoa, 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 whoa. This is the I, same guy. I didn't know. I didn't I didn't know you went to the A's game, Docs. This, this was okay. This was the same guy that was pissing in the sink while I was sitting on the toilet. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's what men do. Men do that. They don't they don't show off and, and have their hey shout their, out to the nation. Shout, shout their out beautiful to the wife, you know, who's who's their life partner giving them fellatio at a at a sporting event. That's just that's not classy. <laughs> I, I never, I would never. That's that's that's, that's actually go shit. To be honest with you. Oh my god! Not everybody here in the building, man. We just did he give you a ticket, ticket, docs, or did you have to pay for it? <laughs> All right, motherfucker. All right. All right. Hey, so hey, the other day, right? <coughs> you and wasted was live, and I left a comment, and I didn't know that your wife was sitting on the couch behind you. She wasn't. Yes, she was. 
what happened? You talking about when, talking about when we we're talking about uh, um, punk ass uh, Waller that day? No, we were. T- you were on wait. You and Wasted did a show. Yeah. And y'all were talking about something, and then I left the comment and was like, um, "Chrissy came. About- Chrissy came down the steps." Yeah, I didn't know. I, I didn't know. What, he, was, what, the, what was the comment? I said something like, "Like Stu would have missed his his wedding." Uh, for, oh, for, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. For, yeah, for yeah. a third date with his side bitch or some shit, right? I was like, "Yeah, I would have, bro." So I'm commenting and I'm seeing everybody in the comment section like, "Grab, bro!" Like Stu's wife is in the back. I said, "What?" No, she just came down and it was perfect timing because I was like, "Baby, would you want me to go?" I, oh, I, I, I explained it to her. I was like, "Yo, there's this Raiders player that didn't go to the the preseason game." Cause he went and watched her basketball game, and she's like, "Are you still that on that, dude?" She, no, he, dude, he just brought up my wife. I'm talking about um, the the reason she was downstairs. Okay, B. Well, got got okay, you. and uh, just hey, hang with us, all right, hey, buddy. B, B, hey, and don't apologize. Don't Stay folk. Yeah, don't. Yeah, fuck. <laughs> I ain't apologizing for shit. No, and and then she just she 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 was coming down the steps, but she don't she don't care about that shit. Hey, hey let me. No, I I told Wade. Been together for twenty one years, man. I, mean, I already know. She, she ain't I, going she, nowhere. She expects that shit at this point. She hey, hey, let me let me ask y'all this: What are you what are you most excited about with this trips? For those who don't know, we'll all be in California tomorrow, high desert for the Adelanto trip. Uh, we're gonna be in Vegas also, you guys. Thursday, Friday, uh, we got some business out there. Stu has the uh. What is it? The alum, the, the alum, yeah, the Raiders alumni reunion. Um, so we're all there's like 280 former players, and I want to say we're going to be at the game watching it in the let's see, in the uh Nike alumni polo, blah blah blah. We're going to be in one of oh, in the wind club, the wind field club, we're all going to be at, yeah. Sounds like it's on the feet. That's on the field. Yeah, it's on the bottom. It's it's right where it's right it's under a touchdown, where, right? It's like where the families the right. Yeah, right where the families sit, um, behind the end zone. Okay, right. yeah. So we'll we'll all be there, dude. There's a there's a bunch of like last year. I think there was 150 alumni. This year it's like 280. I mean, almost double. Yeah. yeah, it's gonna be, dude. It's gonna be fucking awesome. What, what, what names? What names have you heard? Like any rumblings of any any any? Names? Well, I know, I know, like. I, I know Hostetler is a name that that came. Fire, up. bro! Like, come on, Haas. Uh, yep. Um, God, I went through the whole. It, it's there's a lot of guys. I mean, okay. you're. I'm I'm trying to think. I don't know if Marcus will be there. Okay. Um, hopefully he won't. Um, Fuck. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. You can't gloss over that shit. Yeah. Why would you? Why you don't like you don't like? He he, he his whole thing was fucking dudes wise, man. Like I just don't fuck with. I don't fuck with that shit. He said, "I'm Tyrone. I came here to fuck your wife." Yeah, Long I mean, it's just like it's just that was like his thing, and like I just I don't respect that shit. That's just not. Hey, hey, I, hey, I respect it. I respect it. Hey, so I remember you were saying maybe McFadden, Jacoby Ford. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, McFadden, Jacoby Ford. Um, uh, fuck. I mean, all all like you know, guys like from my class would be like you know, um, um. Uh, Fabian Washington. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. I don't think Kirk will because I'm sure he's probably working a game. But uh, Justin Fargus, um, Rod Woodson, um, Andre Risen will probably be there. Uh, Zach Miller. Oh man, uh, Legend. Uh, Legend. Uh, I'm thinking. Uh, hopefully Jerry Porter. What about Tim? Gabriel. Will Timmy be there? Tim, Tim Brown will be there. Tim oh, Brown will be there. Um, then you'll have like um, Val, Val Piano. Val, Val Piano. Yep. Mm-hmm. He'll he'll be there. Um, I'm sure Charlie Garner will be there. Uh, Beast Mode will probably be there. Um, you know, I, I'm hoping I'm hoping that um, uh, uh, Khalif Barnes should be oh, there. Yeah, yeah. Um, then you'll have guys like um, fuck. It'll be a whole bunch of there's a whole bu- dude. It's a lot. Say, it's bro, a lot. Like so school. many Raiders like. I'm Legend. sure Lester Lester Hayes. Oh, um, yeah. Um, I'm hoping uh, McElroy will be there. Obviously, George Atkins, Jim Otto, uh, Art, oh, man. Art Shell may be life. there. Um, Plunkett obviously will be there. Jerry Rice probably not. Richard Seymour probably. Randy Moss probably no. Randy Moss won't come. Um, 
because Randy Moss won't come because of the you know you guys cat you know fucking gave him too much shit, man. That's right. hey, real quick. Hey, Derek. <clears throat> yeah, he, he texted me. Um, yeah, bro. He wanted to still come on the live, and I was like, bro, there's no way. Like, he couldn't even spell the words that he was texting. Shout to my bro, man. <laughs> hey, you have to shoot shoot me his number when you get a chance. Okay, I'd like yeah. to give him a, give him a call just to, just to kind of talk to him. Uh, I was gonna say he's he's gonna be out there this weekend. Yeah. yeah, that's what he said. Yeah, he mm -hmm. better he better fucking sober up because I'm telling you, if he's already hurting right now, boy, it's gonna get a lot worse. Uh, oh. <laughs> Rich Gannon, pro I'm, I'm sure Rich Gannon is there because I think he does the radio, right? Doesn't he? Yes. Yeah, so he'll he'll be there. Uh, I'm just trying to think of some of the the names I I, I remember yeah, when I through it, but yeah, there, it'll be a lot, dude. It'll be it'll be a lot. It'll be a lot, and I'm gonna I'm gonna have my little my home video camera, dude. I'm gonna get some like family video footage too it'll be it'll be fun dude it'll be fucking it'll be fun i'm shout to halo i thought you had somebody coming out for the video I, well we had budget cuts bro you know what i'm saying oh, like gotcha, we all, gotcha. yeah so he was unfortunately say less, say less, say less. i just found out that he yeah he, he won't be able to make it so i'm i'm gonna do it myself which i think it's a little bit more personal anyways i think i'll get more um personal content you know what i'm saying since it's 100%. me yeah. Well, we're, we're going to be shooting everything. So, you know what I mean? It's all right. good. And so you guys make, just so you guys understand, we're going to have content all over, all across the board this, this weekend, Stu's channel, my channel, Andy's channel, Hammer's channel. I know Wasted can't make it because he has COVID. Uh, rest up, big bro. Yeah, that but, um, sucks. Yeah, but I'm going to make sure to attach his channel to my channel with anything that I upload. So he gets some content on his channel as well. Um, I, I know Mitch will probably upload a few things over there at the Las Vegas Raiders report. So we're going to be all, all across the board, hoping that my brother Cody can somehow, some way pop out. Samoan's going to get a bunch of shit. He usually has his like camera on him. So he's running around and shit. Uh, hey, Lo, I just text you, brother. I'm thinking about buying some tickets for the game too, because Stu don't got the pool that he once had. So, um, you know, uh, I got to pay, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, just, Hey, don't, I'm, don't ever, I'm just fucking around. Don't ever count. Don't, don't ever count. Hey, stop me apologizing, out. bro. Stop apologizing. Yeah, hey, hey, yeah, for hey, real. Hey, you sorry, bitch man. ass motherfucker. No wonder you <laughs> drinking a cup of cum. Hey, remember. <laughs> hey, remember. We only need two what bitches. Do. Hey, remember. B can't go. It's only me and Tip. I don't even trip. Um, shout out to Auntie Six Man. Get your tickets now. I'm wearing Stu's jersey. Shout out to me. That's dope. Hell yeah. Fuck That's yeah. Dope. That is dope, dope, bro. Real, real fast. Shout out to Dinah as well. Glad you're feeling better, Doc Stu. I'm still asking for a jersey. Laugh out loud. Is that event this weekend? Yes, it is. It is in Atalanto. Hey, Dinah, pull up and Stu will sign anything you have. Yeah. Real shit. Make sure you pull up. And we can have a beer fucking. Yeah, man. Hey, Warren, Warren Sapp's going to be there. Yeah. Bunch of other motherfuckers going to be in the building. Bring whatever you can and, and get it signed. All the content creators, a lot yeah, of people yeah. that you, you see. But you'll get a chance to meet them in, in public and ask some questions and just hang out, dude. It's gonna be a a chill event, dude. You're gonna we're, we're gonna be just relaxing, dude. It's gonna be we're, fun. We're gonna have a good. We're gonna be having a good fucking time. Yeah. Hey, Willis, hey, what do you want for those tickets, brother? Let me know. Let me know what you want. DM me, and I'll definitely get those up off you, man. Definitely, because while I'm there, I might as well. We might as well go to the game. You know okay, saying? Graham. I'd love to. I'd love to have Jared there. Yeah, he says he's got an autograph of me and Jared. I, I can't get a hold of the guy, but. Uh, yeah, that sucks. I don't know where he's at or how he's doing, but he'd be great to have. That was my dude out in fucking uh, in 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 uh, Oakland. So yeah, I'd love to have him there, but he won't be. Hey, Squid, I told Halo to not dress, bro. So Squid, if you can just look, if you want to just throw it on for ten minutes or some shit. The cool thing is, we're getting to Adelanto. Squid, right you better be careful too, bro. You better have a fish tank or something to swim in, motherfucker. <laughs> God damn, you're gonna dry the fuck out. <laughs> hey, the good thing is, it's in the nineties, like low nineties, I believe, like. It's been hot, like 110, 114. Like, yeah, it's, bro, it's, the, the whole week we're there is going to be cool as fuck. I told, oh, bro, man. I told Halo a while back ago, there's a way you can get like something that goes underneath your bodysuit that, that'll keep you cool. But I don't know if you ever looked into that. Shit. I saw, dude, I saw something recently on like yeah. uh, maybe an ad on Instagram or some like. Right, right. Or, right. or no, it was like, it, I was on like, YouTube and I looked it, up like. um, it, It's I like a full up, body. It's like a full body thing, you know what I mean? I, I looked cool. up like new gadgets for like 2000, 2022 or something, and it was in there, dude. It was it, it looked pretty sweet. Shout out to everybody here in the building, man. Wipe them feet, hit them thumbs up. If you're not subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button. Also, go over to Stu's channel, man. Stuart Schweiger 
on YouTube. And make sure you guys give our brother, a, uh, you know, hit that subscribe button as well. Also, B's channel is on the way. And we're going to do something new this season. Oh, you talk guys. about Thor's out. Thor's too. On oh, yeah. Thor. Big bro, we will be there Thursday. We will be at your house Thursday. No, Friday. Friday. Oh, Friday for the Friday. barbecue. We will yep. be there for the barbecue. Um, I got a meeting at, at, and then right after that, I'm, I'm well, cause I have a, I have a video too. I have to re or I have to do an interview at 1230 to like 1250. So there you go. Um, this, this year, you guys, we're going to start something new. We're going to have a, a, a B he's going to do his own show this year. We're going to have him do something this uh, on the channel and tell bro gets his channel moving. Frozen? Huh? Is he frozen right now? He, nah, he's just, he just, yeah. Oh, well, he was frozen. He better fix his fucking if he wants to have a show. I know, right? What the fuck? Get your Wi-Fi together. What the fuck, bro? Yeah, no shit. You know hey, B oh, show thanks, Terrence. Thanks, Terrence. B show is canceled, Jaws. Yeah. It's not happening. Like, real shit. He, he, just, he just showed who the fuck he really was, and now yeah. it's, it's, it's over. All that apologetic shit, too. Like, I yeah, thought, you were, from, I thought you were from Sacramento. I didn't know Sacramento got to apologize so fucking much. Unreliable as fuck, man. You know what I mean? It's just some bullshit, bro. Yo, I don't know. What the fuck happened, bro? Yeah, man. All of a sudden, y'all started tweaking, and then it should. What do you oh got? Your, uh, your internet's on the lease? What do you got? Your... <laughs> Fuck you. Leased, you leased your internet? <laughs> <laughs> He's stupid. But, hey, this year, you guys, we're going to do it. me, Paige. For we're gonna do a, we're, he's going to have his own show on the channel. And, and gonna, hey, you're up. Go ahead, dude. Go. You're on. Good. Hey, hey, real talk, man. Hey, it's time, bro. Like, why not? Hey, right now, let's see. You know, no, right now, hey, I'm, I'm muting myself. But we want him to talk Raiders and and, and uh in, in real estate. So hey, yep. the Raider Realtor, right? The Raider Realtor. Yep, yep. Why not? Hey, <laughs> let him get. Hey, let him get three minutes right now. Hey, you just mute your shit, Docs. Ready? One, two, three. This motherfucker, bro. This motherfucker. Oh, what what y'all what y'all want me to say? Y'all want me to start pitching some shit? Like, yo, he fumbled the bag, bro. He fumbled the bag. He fumbled Double the bag. bag, boy. Wanna motherfucking yeah, 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 y'all on some shit right now. Dude, yeah, no, but... that you dude, you gotta you gotta be you gotta go. Okay, ready? We'll give you a minute. Ready, docs? One, two, three, mute. And there you go. Um <laughs> dude, you can't have dead air, bro. That's yeah, the worst yeah, thing. Yeah. Fumble the rock, man. Shout out to Shane Tolbert, Sacktown Raider fans taking over YouTube. Talk that shit, my brother. Um Better say something. They put you on the spot. Shout out to Sinister. Long he said, just don't apologize. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't apologizing for shit. Uh, somebody said they see you at the <laughs> airport, bro. They see me where? I seen B at the airport in Vegas a few months ago at the draft. How was good, B? Yeah. What? What's good? What's good? Hell yeah. Look a beasy like cereal. You gotta be from Northern California with that name. What up, Jason Thomas? <laughs> Milk a beasy like you gotta be from the crib. Hey, you guys, we're having some fun tonight, man. Look, we're not gonna break down the roster, we're not gonna do any of the other shit. We'll talk some Raider football, but we're talking about Adelanto. Look, you guys, this is probably the last live that I'm really gonna be able to pull off until Saturday because I don't know yeah. what the fuck that Wi-Fi is gonna look like out there, and we're gonna be working and we're gonna be running around. So, uh, you know, I wanted to just have some fun with my brothers before we get out there, bust the moves, because it's going to be work, 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 work. And, and Dude, we're, we're literally T minus like 13 hours before I wouldn't see you. Yeah. And, and school is definitely going to be blacked out drunk by the time he gets to Dallas in the morning. This is see, fact. I'm y'all, y'all motherfuckers, you want to joke around with that shit and talk, you know, talk about me drinking and stuff, motherfucker. I've been. Okay. <laughs> He's gonna say I've been drinking before you were born. Type shit. I, I just I I already got a warning for hey Stu man, just if you're gonna be out there and they're doing all that, you know, that <laughs> cannabis stuff, you be careful with this. And I'm like, thank thank you. I, bro, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. Stu, bro, I said that. I was the person that said Stu be cool, bro, because this weed is strong as no, shit. No, 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 no. This was a, on a uh this was on a stream a couple weeks ago. They were trying to warn me, and I'm like I, I, listen, guys, I appreciate it, but I think I, I th well, you're like, I think I got it. Stu was smoking some high tech ass shit and asking the most fire ass questions in the world. These motherfuckers didn't even have right. no answers. They were looking at Stu like, uh, business questions too. Business. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? It, 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 like, it was like, wow. Like, okay. Stu really on his shit. Like, okay. That's how you, that's how you use 
drugs do. as a that's professional. That's what that's what professionals that's what professionals do. You're better than me. Do. I would have hit that shit all the way. You probably smoked and got hella intellectual on him. Like, what's up with this? What's up with that? What's up? With that? Bro, I would have uh, smoked. It, it no, nah, that that's other stuff that usually gets me kind of fucking. Uh, let's say uh, focused. I would have smoked that shit and walked back to the airport. <laughs> It'd have been over. Been done, He's like, bro. fuck everything. Fuck everybody. I got to go. I'm no, I have, a, I have a very high tolerance. It's just, I, I think it's high. I think my, my body, uh, like, uh, uh, flushes. Metabolizes or it. Metabolizes. Yeah, metabolizes things really fast. So I need a lot. Hey, hey, hard conversations. We, we'll definitely chop it up with you. Cause B does has his, he does have his license in Nevada and California. So, Reach out to my matter of fact, reach out to me in the DM and I'll I'll plug you in with B on, on IG. 100%. Y'all definitely can work. I'm duly together. licensed in, in California and Nevada. So anywhere in between, you know, you yeah. just let me know. Yeah. Fast. Hey, uh, someone Raider Rick asked about is there an easier way to get some Raider pants pants are tough to get, dude. I mean, it's just you just don't there's not like a really a market for them. I mean You said pants? Uh, Raider Rick is asking for pants. I think he wants to sniff the crotch or something. So I, I don't, <laughs> I have some of my practice pants and shit, but they're like, you, it's just, you don't see pants too often. So hold on, where Rick at, man? <laughs> Raider Rick. Shout out to my dog, Rick, bro. Hold on. <laughs> what the fuck is Snoopy says. I could probably, I could probably sneak in the locker room and, and snatch a jock strap for you or something. Oh, shit. I see it. I see it. Raider game pants besides looking on eBay. I got you. I got you. Hey, Dinah. Trust me, you don't need to bring any weed. The weed will be there. It, it, it is literally a cannabis festival, brother. You don't need to bring shit. Yeah, it's going to be. Just bring yourself. I'm telling right. you. Right. Shout out to Raider Rick, man. Yeah, bro. He says. Yeah, something. dude, it's going to be a bunch of just, it's, dude, it's a Raiders party. It's a reason for Raider Nation to get together, dude. Like, who yeah. gives a fuck about who's performing or who's going to be there? It's just about getting together and talking Raiders. It'll be after the last preseason game. So we can really, you know, hopefully yeah. this preseason game coming up. No, no, no one plays in this one, right? Or, or, or do no, they? No. Okay. And today, man, they said that we dominated New England in in that cross practice. We did a joint practice. Oh, they're them. out here right now. Yeah, they said, bro, we smoked them on both sides of the ball. Like See, that's pretty the, cool, though. I, I guarantee you, our guys, like our people, our our uh, oh, Jesus Christ, blah, 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 blah. our Patriots people on the Raider staff. It's kind of cool to have them here all week to chop right. it up and stuff, you know? Yeah. Oh, definitely. Definitely. But it's, it's still good to know that like right now they said, the, like, I think they said DC went seven for seven or some shit and like, like on seven passes and Devonte had like a 40 yard touchdown down to, like, bro. Like he smoked their corner, like insanely. Our new guy, Jayon Brown that came from Tennessee had two INTs, one in the red zone. Like we, we were fucking him up. Really? Yeah. Yeah. So, you okay. know, hey, that's a good. Who was it? Who was it? Jayon Brown, the, the linebacker we brought in from uh, Tennessee. When did we bring him in? This year, in the free agency. We did. Okay. So, so I have a. You, you, you've talked about him before. Okay. I think, I think okay. you just kind of, you, you probably just kind of, there's so many goddamn players. You know how this shit go. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. You know what I mean? But um, yeah, Adams had a one handed catch, T, facts. Um, they said that it, this offense looked explosive as shit without Waller even out there. Like it looked insane. Um, and what's funny is all who, Boston. Who was getting reps at running back? Um, Josh. Josh was out there. Um, we just cut Drake. Like we just cut Drake. Last, yeah, we just cut yeah. Drake. So he's out of there. That's good. We we thought that. We figured that. Yeah. I mean, we, we knew he wasn't going to make the writing ball. was on the wall. The writing was on the wall. Yeah. yeah. But um, I guess that was the only low key black eye that we had was. I heard that New England's run defense looked good in training camp, so I assume that our run game wasn't as as, as great as we, you know. Well, they're 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 one of their defensive captains and middle linebackers, Jawan Bentley, who's a former Purdue guy. He's a good. He's a pretty good fucking. He's all run stopping. So, yeah. right. Hey, and, and guess who else is looking really good right now, Stu? Someone, uh, that you, someone uh, that your boy told us about. Uh, someone. Remember. Darius Phillips. You remember you spoke to the D, D coordinator at Cincinnati. About him? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's yeah. looking good. It's looked like he carved a roll with us, man. You're going to get some corner, some corner let me, burn. Let me just reiterate. Let's see what he uh, what he said about, about him. Yeah, corner burn. I was going to say, for as much shit as we've been given, like, you know, our right tackle position and our defensive, like, obviously defensive tackle position, like, we're doing pretty good in, in, in preseason overall. And I, and I know it's just preseason, but it's just one of those things where it shows, like, we got some depth and we're looking pretty good. Like 
even yeah. at the second, third, fourth level. You know what I mean? And so well, I, I feel like we look we looked organized and we know what the fuck's going on. Right, right, you know right. No, and that's so that's, yeah. So here's what here's what he said about Darius Phillips, and this is Lou Anarumo, the defensive coordinator for the for the Bengals, who's a close friend of mine. He says, uh, very good ball skills, better zone guy than man, better short area quicks than long speed. Uh, been hurt a bunch. Worth a look at for sure. Yep. So he's he looks like he's, he he's he looks that like he's like a, a very fair assessment. A though. nickel, a nickel inside guy, right? Right. Yeah, or, right. But he's even got some burn on the outside. But he, and he's a special teams guy too. Cool. Cool. Yeah. So he he's been looking good. He's been looking really good. Um, he's twenty seven. You know, what I mean, he he can probably hit his stride now. You know, what I'm saying like, I'm here yeah, for. What, it. What's the year? What's the deal with Wally? Wally Waller. I know how you feel about Waller. There's I'm, nothing to really update. He wasn't out there. But they said that, just like Raider Rick said, the Patriots writer said Carr ran for when Adams carved him up. Said he couldn't even imagine if Waller was out there too. If, if, at that point, it's just – What's just, wrong with Waller? What's the deal? He has a hamstring issue. Oh. Right? So, but that's so – he, he hasn't practiced at all during – He came camp? back and practiced. After we went on that tirade that one day, uh -huh. he came back the following day, practiced, and then got held out the following practice again. So I don't know. Maybe this hamstring issue can be more severe than what we thought it was, or maybe well, they can be. They can be very. They can the soft those soft tissue injuries, like you know my calf or hamstrings or quads and shit like that. Like you, if you're not like a hundred percent and you come back too early, let's say you come back at like eighty percent, like a sprained ankle or like a broken bone, you can play on it, right? Like it's yeah. just you got to get through the pain, but. A, Something like that, one wrong cut or move, and all of a sudden, pop, you know, you're back to you're back mm -hmm. to fucking fifty percent real fucking quick. Hey, Er, yeah. the th the thing is this, my brother, Waller hasn't been hurt every year since he's come in. He didn't really start experiencing injuries until last year, and, and with and with Jacobs, he's been getting it all because he's been first of all, Gruden was running his ass down to to, to his kneecaps. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, that's and, what and his hi and his history took years off his body. Yes. That abuse, yes. that that the the drug abuse and alcohol. I don't know if you oh, had alcohol issues, but wow. that that stuff like it takes it, a toll over time. It does, yeah. And he's not young. I mean, how old is he in his thirty? He's thirty, right? He's 29, 29, 30, right? And I know how well I took care of my body. I mean, I didn't, you know. Now I'm done and old. I'm I'm experienced and stuff. But back then, dude, I didn't. I drank a little bit, but other than that, dude, I was my I was on like my my body was everything to me right. and. I was I was starting to break down at 30, 31. You know what I'm saying? So I know he's got to be feeling it a little bit. And that's what I'm saying. Like, we we have him. He signed. Let's just go through this year and then we'll see what happens after this year. Why re, re, re up right now? There's no reason to. Fuck it. What, is, it is, he, is he two years left on the contract? Like two cool. years? Yeah. 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 So I gotta like, say this to you guys. Out, if, if, it's, it's like a it's like a risk reward thing, right? Where it's like, if he goes out and balls out this year, he's gonna want the fat contract at the end of next year. You know what I mean? Like, for sure. And, but at the end of the day, him, if he gets re injured, you know what I mean, and he doesn't produce this year, and then we didn't resign him, then that's a win. That's a win for, for the team. I just so. feel like Clutch is saying, Raiders, we want to make him the highest paid tight end in the league, and that's tough, man. That's tough. I don't. I don't think. I don't think we need to. I think. I think top five would be would would maybe if he was 25, 26. Yeah, but right. Not at right. this age. I mean, you're just especially having a nagging injury like what was it last year that was wrong with him? Um, I think it was. Wasn't it? Was it? Was it a hammy or was it his back? It was. It was something. If it's a hammy, that that thing's just going to keep nagging, dude. He's. It's not yeah. going to. You can't have surgery on it. It's not going to get any better. It's something that's it's dude. It's a ticking time bomb. I mean, literally, you could be feeling great for the next six weeks, go out there and not stretch right or something, and think, and it's he's, he's done. You know, mm -hmm. done. Was I think it was his hammy last year too. So yeah, so that's it's. Oh no, it was his back. It was his yeah, back. Can you tell them to shut up? Oh no, it wasn't his back. Remember, it was the IT band. That's what it was. It was his IT band last year. That's what it was. I, I, that's weird. I, I, it band is, is typically not something that's like a, a, a an injury. You know what I mean? Like, Hey babe. Well, hey, how'd your game go? Shout out to Mitch. He said, sorry, I couldn't join. Yeah. Take a shot for me. Do you have Venmo graphic? 
<laughs> my oldest here, Cameron. Hey, how you doing? She just got done with her first volleyball game. Let's go. How'd you do? I did fine. Okay. She's playing volleyball. She's going to see if she wants to play volleyball or soccer when she gets to high school. So she's trying volleyball out for the first time. So that's the only way you're going to learn to know what you like. Right. Yeah. 100%. yeah, it was his back too. Yeah, he did have he did have a lingering back injury too. All right, say bye. All right, bye. <laughs> Little stew. Yeah, my son actually, my son kicked ass in soccer this week in his first soccer game. He had three goals, man. It was awesome. That's, that's, that's dope, badass. Bro. That's yep. dope. Anyways, yeah. So I, we don't. He's he's under our. He he's under their time table. He's not calling any shot. He doesn't have leverage at this point in his career to be calling the shots. You know what I'm saying? We have all the leverage, so yeah. let's use it. Yeah, right. Facts. Right. Let me see. Shout out to everybody here in the building. That's, man. Probably the, that's probably the one thing, I guess, like the one good thing Mayock and Gruden actually did was was lock in that contract that they did with him when, when they did, you know, like. That's that's part of it. He shouldn't have signed that long-term contract then. Right, right. You know, that's why guys don't – I don't know what how long was it back then? <laughs> how, long, how long was the contract back then? I think it was like a three-year contract, right, <laughs> wasn't it? Like a three-year extension or something? Which one? For uh, for Waller, Waller. wasn't it like wasn't it like a three year extension? I think it was. Oh, so that was the beginning of last year. He did that then. Yes, maybe. Yeah, yeah. He got paid uh, last year. I mean, what the f- like? And it, and, and w- what's crazy? If it wasn't last year, it was the year before that. But what's crazy is after he got paid, I think it was either Kelsey or Kittle had a fucking. <laughs> Bro, I don't know why that shit is so hilarious to me, bro. Alex Leatherwood says, "Hey Bart, I'd pancake your mom." What did Bart? What did Bart say about him? I don't even fucking know. Leatherwood, you still start at oh, Guar's, Guar's position, Guar's position. <laughs> oh, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't fuck with Leatherwood. Hey, you know what's man. crazy? I've, I've been talking. I've been talking that shit about Leatherwood. Oh shit! At, at Tony right Gonzalez is in here, bro. I block better than Leatherwood. Tony Gonzalez is in here, bro. For, for oh, a while, up. bro. Damn. Oh, real, let me read the super real quick. How about J- uh, J.C. Jackson getting minor ankle surgery? We talked about – I talked about this on my earlier live today, uh, Sin Cal, but he's out two to four weeks. That The Chargers' number one corner is probably going to miss week one against us. That Perfect. means that Devontae Adams is going to have about 300 uh, receivers. Perfect. Yards, bro. That's and, why – see, that's why you, you. it's so hard to give any type of predictions or whatever because – Shit like this. I mean, that's that's a that's that's why football is such a great. Well, it's a great sport, but a tough sport. Like a, one little ankle could ruin your whole fucking season. Right. That's Literally, right. like one right. play, one one player, one play can ruin your whole fucking year and right. and and end people's careers and jobs and shit like that. That's why like every single play matters. That's why it's so intense. That's why it's so fucking. You know, like it's. It wears on you because, again, there's just so much pressure. Every play, even in practice, it's so pivotal because you need every second you can. And then also, too, something like this. And a guy makes a wrong turn, you know, and, and your quarterback's out the whole year. Your season's fucked. Or, right. you know, yeah. you're, you're two-time it's usually, it's Super usually Bowl. The, it's usually the, the, the non-contact injuries that really are detrimental more so than – or. Or you have your, you know, MVP quarterback try to slide in the end zone, get his neck broken by Derrick Brooks, and it ruins the whole next 20 years. I mean, literally. That's fact. Like, yeah. it's, it's crazy. Hey, let me, ask, let me ask you guys this. Did you guys see um, that hit the other day? The Giants played oh, – shit. Who did they play? I, 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 the Giants, you said? The Giants played the Bengals. I didn't um, see it. I'm the, pull it up. The, young, the young rookie out of Oregon. I feel uh, like I might have. I might have. I it, might. It, have. it went viral. Everybody's saying it was a it was a dirty hit. So um, again, it was Giants. I think Bengals. It was, I think Giants and Bengals, right? Hey, hey, Stu can't pull it up on screen because we're on your stream. No, I'm right? not. I'm not. I'm. No, but I'm I, but I wanted to see this. Thing. You know, they, they said it was a cut block, which it was. David but, Webb uh, hits Alex Beckman for. No, no, it was it was Thibodeau. It, it was it was Tim, the rookie Tim Simone Fox forces fumble. Who is it? What's the um, name? Of it? it was Bengals Giants, and it was Thibodeau. It was a chop block, but the uh, but the it's Kayvon Thibodeau. But but the the thing is though, the chop block is legal. Oh, here it's it is. Legal. Here it is. Here it is. Suffers a knee injury. 
Yeah, he's missing, I believe, two to four weeks or something like that. So he's missing like a month. Oh, it was against this guy. Yes. yes. Okay. Watch, watch the play, and let me tell me what you think about this. I'm going to look at it right now. Oh, this is the dude who came out of Oregon, right? This is the end that came out of Oregon. Oh, that that fucking guy who I who I thought I thought he was a bust. Sorry, not a bust, but I thought he was overrated. Yes, you 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 were always saying that because I know you were always. Uh, he was the number one recruit coming out of high school, and yes. I'm looking at his stats. He was all American, and his stats were for yeah. really garbage. Definitely. It, I mean, it looked like a clean hit to me, but it was a little low. But but as as a former. As a former player, Stu, did you see the player? Not yet. It's, 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 hold on. Do, do you think they need to just take the chop block out, of, out, out period? Okay. Uh, okay. Why can't, what, how'd you, what, what are you looking on? What did right, you I'll, watch I'll, that on, B? Let me see. I'm on YouTube, bro. Okay, Ron. I know, but what'd you type in? All I, all I did was uh, Giants versus Bengals. And it was like the second thing that popped up. Field position with their special teams. I'll send it to you right now. Hold on. <clears throat> I'll, I'll literally send it to your phone. Hold on. Yeah, see, I can't play it because it'll fucking monetize my. Yeah, video. maybe, maybe send. No, don't, send don't, 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 don't play it, bro. Yeah, but here, I, I'm, I'm, I'm send, I just sent it to your text, bro. Okay, let me let me take a look here. So, because you, you, we're not going to be able to really get your opinion on it until you actually see. It. So watch the chop that. So at the beginning of it, you're going to see it from from up top. So you're not going to really be able to see the chop block like that. Yeah, that, that's all I watched was was, was the top end. No, but it's going to show it's going to show it in in in, in, in uh, instant replay. Okay, well I didn't I didn't see the instant replay. And people, what are people saying? Oh, it was Randy Moss's son. I didn't know that was Thad Moss. That was Thad Moss. Okay, so here's here's the second Every, look. Everyone was saying it was a dirty play, but then former players were hitting Twitter like, look, you guys, this is a regular typical play. That's, that's a clean – that was like a clean block to me. They're saying it should be out of the game, but it's it's, it's legal. Nah, it's the, that looks, is Randy's son a tight end? Yeah. Yep. I'm going to be honest, bro. It looks like a clean play to me. I've, I've seen people – listen, I've seen people go lower. You know Dude. what I mean? I've seen people get way lower. That's yeah, that's nothing. That's that's a no, bad no, play, but no, that's no. a that's an unathletic play by the DN not to secure his his knees. That you go over drills like that in practice every day. Right. Like he he his feet were planted in the ground, like yeah. jump. Like when I saw someone going low, you either avoid it or you jump. Right. You know I and mean? so your legs aren't caught. You might flip and people might go, ooh, but it doesn't hurt. I mean his right. Feet were planted. I mean, first of all, he's he's not. First of all, he's not even going fast. I mean, oh. he's coming in, and he turns sideways. Like yeah. I, oh, it, yeah. no, SVT Sanjita's is right, and he's a, he's a former offensive lineman. Technically, it is clean. Yeah, it's absolutely. Clean clean. That's it. It's it, it's it, it's a clean chop block to me. And I think that Thibodeau should have got lower on that. Uh, 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 you know what I'm saying? Uh, I mean, I, I, that's what they used to say. Like if there was pulling guards or fullbacks and you were a safety holding the edge, you chop them guys and make a pile. Yeah. Right. I don't right. think you can do that anymore, though. I don't think defensive players can, can cut or chop offensive players, can they? I'm not sure. Mitch, you you crazy, man. You're fucking crazy. Bro. He looked, That was a terrible, unathletic play by Thibodeau. You know what I'm saying? Like that I he, agree. Needs, to, he I agree. needs to know how to take on a fucking chop block. Uh, yeah. I mean, especially yeah. on a guy who's smaller level. than him, you expect the chop block. 100 percent Yeah. 100 percent But he he fucking Mitch. Shout yeah. out to my brother Mitch. Um, shout to Hammer in the building. Lil Bro, what's goody, man? Can't wait to see you this weekend. Up, Hammer? Bro? Hey, so Stu, it's funny. You get to see Hammer for the first time. You get to see Andy for the first time. Um, oh yeah, uh, Thor. No, I I, I seen Thor a long time ago because yeah. I it was in those videos of the Sixty Six Street Bob. Shout out R.I.P. to yeah. Um, shit, what the fuck, is, man? This fucking fly is killing me, bro. Um, um, but uh, also too, I think Dirty Dirty's gonna be out there. Dirty's coming. Yeah, he'll yeah. be out there. I, well, from what I see, I heard he said he was gonna be out there. So I mean, everybody's supposed to be. Look, Gabe is right out. He's right down the street. Gabe will be. No, out I, there. Can't, I can't wait to punk all the motherfuckers. 
Shit's it's... gonna be real funny until you fucking see me. And I'm gonna fucking <laughs> yeah. Well, hey, hey, uh, Andy, what do you gotta say about fucking um, my boy fucking Olson now, huh? You're fucking stupid, bro. Yeah, shit's a little bit different now. <laughs> That six that six three two forty five looks different in real life than it does on the hey, computer. Hey, hey, Andy gonna be like, "Fuck, is you talking about, bro?" You know what I'm saying? Like, what's up? Like, Andy, a big boy, man. Look, he ain't worried about that shit. He gonna chop block your goofy. I, ass, I didn't boy. know. I didn't know you spoke for him. Are you his fucking? Uh, hey, 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 Northern California. Are you, are you are together. Fucking, we die together, bro. Are you a promo promoter or what here, dude? Hey, I thought. Hey, are you? Am I am I offending you, hey, Doc? Hey, I didn't Northern know you and him were that close. Damn. <laughs> Right, B? I never heard him have your back like that ever. <laughs> I know he's never had mine like that. Shit, you must, you and him must have a special relationship. Hey, Ben Bad, I got you. Hey, somebody put the link to the uh the ticket for the tickets in the chat. You guys can, man. I appreciate hey, it. Man. Hey, hey, so Stu, so what's what, what what's oh the, the can it, the can it, or can or uh, what is it? It's uh can canes c a n e s dot com and eventbrite.com. Yo, my brother Mitch is fucking crazy. So right well, now... Well, Stu is scary. <laughs> Mitch, I'm literally going to hold on to this until you get to California. Mitch just sent me a hundred fucking dollars right now. And I know he's probably sitting on his couch drunk as fuck right now just watching the show. <laughs> I'm going to hold on to that and we're going to buy a bottle with it when we get to California. Yeah, no shit. Yeah, hell yeah, dude. All right, all right. Shout out to my bro, man. Mitch, you already know my brother. I appreciate That's you. Cool, man. dude. That's fucking awesome. Yeah, I'm gonna hold on to that. We all look. Hey, that hundred is gonna get us all hammered. I uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna I, lie. Uh, I'm not gonna I lie. threw that him. Fucking, I threw him ten bucks. I threw that whiskey. Uh, that, that, that Mitch put us on when we were in Vegas that last time. That shit was fire, bro. I think it was the uh, like a peanut butter whiskey or some shit. That shit was that shit was fire, bro. Which one? You don't remember, you don't remember that shit when we were over at the fucking Raiders bar in Vegas, Mitch? What what was that peanut butter whiskey that we were drinking at? Uh, uh, you, you uh, talking about that, that the Raider Tavern in there? Yeah, oh, no, at the tavern. tavern. No, 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 not that one. No, 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 not a tavern. No, no, no. It was at uh, what, what's that spot called? It, it's not even. It was a screwball. That's what he said. It's called a screwball. Yeah, that shit was. I, I forgot what it was, bro. That shit. Yeah, I mean, if if, if if that's what he says, bro, that shit was fire as fuck, bro. Mitch, I'm definitely fire. gonna send you that money back, and I love you for that, though, bro. Shout out to my guy, Mitch, man. Hey, look, and bro, trust me, I seen you working. You were getting to it. I know how it goes, bro. What is in a screwball? Yeah, I don't know. Everybody, look, everybody's saying it's fucking delicious. Huh? Yeah, it's it's fucking bomb, bro. It's bomb. I will say this: like, I went to like an actual like cocktail lounge where they actually like Pause. Pe people like fucking really know how to make like nice um, cocktails. And getting getting to like a ten dollar, twelve dollar cocktail is a lot better than fucking. Me pouring Crown Royal in a fucking cup of like stale fucking Coke, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, no, it's, hey, wor it's worth it to pay extra for a nice. You you know what's no, crazy? Stu, Stu, B, you know this. B, you know this. Stu likes, uh, he likes the Captain Morgan and the Dr Pepper, right? No, I thought it was, no, I thought no, it was no. Taylor Jerry's. I thought it was Taylor Jerry's. Crown, Crown Royal. No, Crown, I'm sorry, Crown. That's what it was. Crown. I, I, I really, I, I could have a, like maybe one. Crowning doctor because it gets really sugary, dude. But that's what we drank all night when we were at the bar that day. Remember, wasn't it Crowning Dr. Pepper? I don't remember. I was, no, so it was cr crowning, it was no Crowning Cokes. Crowning Cokes. Oh, I thought it was Crowning Dr. Pepper. We, we were at the M, we were at the M Resort, and we oh, were doing yeah, I, I think I was ordering Dr. Pepper with it. Okay, where well, you? It was we, we were, were having a whole bunch of shit. I think we had martinis and fucking, oh, yeah, we, had, up, up, zap, we, we had been up all night long. Just we were, we were starting to catch a second wind. To be honest with you, Shit, I, I I caught my second, and then by my third win, I was ready. To I know I felt bad because you were starting to get hype when you were dropping us off at the airport. And I'm like, damn, he's feeling good right now. Yeah. He's by himself. Yeah. Hey, yeah. everybody that's in the chat that lives in Las Vegas or surrounding me, B and Stu will be in Las Vegas Thursday and Friday. You guys, you guys want to link up? Hey, to be real, you know how we do. We we, we can get everybody together for a quick little yeah. go round. Hey, yeah, let's do it. Let's do hey, it. If you guys are down to meet up Thursday night, Friday, early afternoon or something, bro, we are all down to go find a little bar or something and go kick it. You know 100%. What I'm yeah, no. Yeah, so let's see. My brother. Hey, call me tomorrow, Mitch. Let me see my – yeah, Mitch, dude, hey. No, I, I gave 10 bucks for uh, – what's his buddy that drinks the boot? Bro, oh, oh, uh, uh, Chugs, uh, uh, Jeremy? Jeremy. 
Jeremy? Is it hey, Jeremy? Jeremy? Yeah, 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 yeah. Bro, hey, so I spent the night at Mitch's house the other night. We were fucking blow, bro. It was fucking crazy. Is he in Dallas then? Yeah. He lives in Dallas. Yeah. This pizza that he got, I know. Mitch, did you get the same place? If he got the same place, this shit is a bro. So all Mitch does is use an air fryer for everything. Like, bro, like he'll literally wake up and be like, throw the pizza in the fucking air fryer. I know there. I got one. I know they're super easy. I just bro. haven't gotten into it yet, man. Throw the fucking coffee in the air fryer. Anything, like, dude. Bro, like, don't give a fuck, bro. <laughs> Anything. Hey, that shit was a let me and Tiff were like, what the fuck? Like he would just throw everything in that bro. Yep. Yeah, that shit's hilarious. He said, Hi, "Hey, so I'm Thursday, as far as the reunion goes, we have." Uh, check in at three and then six to 8 PM. It's just a welcome reception in the top floor of the hotel we're at. And then after that, guys are going to be wanting to go out. So we're looking for places to go. Is that the M? No, uh, uh, they don't want me really saying like where everybody's going to be at. Yeah. Right? It's, yeah, it starts with a D. Um, I think it's by the stadium. Oh, I know what it is. So yeah, let's, 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 let's stay less. Let's stay less. Right? It's, we're short, it's we're short stays every time he goes out there. Yeah. So uh, yeah. So, that, we'll so yeah. So Thursday night, it's gonna be a, there's gonna be a lot of guys wanting to fucking go out as far as alumni and stuff. And obviously, we, you can give updates or something. Maybe give like say, can, just fucking we'll, we'll we'll tap in or tap in with us whoever's gonna yeah. be out in Vegas fucking yeah. and we'll tell you guys where to come and fucking. Yeah. No, we're, we're we're gonna set up yeah. something where everybody just come through, kick it, have a drink, vibe out. Smoke a cigar. Um, right. I know. I know we're doing Th Thor's barbecue on Friday. Friday afternoon. Um, right. It's about to be lit. Shout out to Rule Boy. Said I love Stewart's Swagger Real Raider Third Round Gym. Thank Shout you. Out. Thank you. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. I appreciate, I that. I appreciate that. He said meet me at the Regal Beagle. He said let's have a drink. Let's stop. By I don't know if Woodson will be there or not. I'm not sure. Hey, hey, hey Mark Davis is in the comments. Said Stu, don't give out the info. <laughs> 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 hey, hey Stu, so you would be shocked, right? <laughs> I would not be shocked if Mark. Sorry, Mark. I my bad. Bro. So, so you know, I have my boy Paul on. I don't think it's actually in I don't here, think man. Exactly. Leather Leatherwood's in here. Mark Davis bro, is in here. I know. Fucking, what the fuck? Bro. Tony Gonzalez is in here. The Tennessee Titans owner watched a live of mine a week ago and hit up Paul, my boy Paul, the NFL agent, and said you handled those questions uh, uh, greatly. Wait, 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 hold on. Say it again. So Paul, my boy Paul, yeah. shout, out my, shout out to my boy Polly D. Um, you know, he he's an agent for Jeffrey Simmons, one of the best defensive tackles in the league. And, you know, we were, you know, talking, answering questions and blah, blah, blah. And then Andy asked him a really, really good question. And oh, this is while he was on your. Yeah. So Paul hit me the next day and said, bro, it's crazy. He was like, he was like the, the owner of the Tennessee Titans sent me a text and was like, you handled those questions perfectly. Who is the owner of the Titans? Um, I forgot who it was, to be honest. You know, I, does he I, know this guy? I obviously, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Guy, I mean, they, right? you know, they're they're working on one of the biggest contracts. Oh, a, okay. A defensive tackle was ever seen before. You know what I'm right. saying? So um, that's just crazy that this platform, like, you got an owner of of of, of an organization. Dude, watching, it's it's, a, it's, it's a, the platform not like saying that. this bad, but it's a woman, Amy <laughs> Adams Strunk. Yep. Yep. It is. Definitely. And that, that's, that's exactly what he said too. He said her name. Yep. That's her. She, uh, but that's, that's dope though. That's dope. That, that, that university of Texas out of Austin. She's a businesswoman. Yeah. Hey man, look, we're, we're growing, man. We're growing. Shout out to Sin Cal. Take a I shot of screwball with the, so great she was the daughter of late owner, Bud Adams. Yes. Owns half of the Titans franchise with other members of the family owning the remaining half. The team is currently owner under the banner of KSA Industries, which also owns many of Bud Adams' businesses. Before Strunk took over as controlling in 2015, belonged to her sister, Susie Adams Smith, whose husband, Tommy Smith, was team president and CEO. So there you go. That's yeah. pretty dope. But that That's was actually dope. fire. Shout out to Sincal. I'm going to try to taste just like peanut butter. And jelly sand a sandwich. Take a shot of screwball with grape juice chaser and a dab of salt. Tastes like PBJ. Huh. Interesting. That would, yeah, Raiders, that, would, that would be a that, that would be um fire. Shout out to Raiders, man. Hey, my, my boy, girly, a girly, pretty girly fucking shot, but I guess if that's what you guys are going for, that's cool. Nah, bro. I'm telling you, this shit that, that whiskey fire, bro. You're tripping. Shout out to hey, shout out to Raiders. 90 percent or something. No, bro. It's 40, it's it's a 80 proof, bro. Hey man, shout out to Raiders. I pre let, 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 let bro get some sleep, man. He, he don't need to pop in. Shout out to Hollywood. Ooh. 
Hey, that to, bro. Hey, that's family, man. Like real talk. Like I really rock with Mitch B. You know Mitch in real life, bro. Like, that's our that's our fam. Like we we don't we don't look at him like somebody else that would just cancel. Even when Stu doesn't fucking show up, this is family. I don't get mad. You know what I mean? I, like I know Stu Stu cats off all the time, bro. Like, sometimes I want to kick him in his dick, but I'm like, but it's cool. Like I'm like this family. Though, hey, I, I miss my own shows. Yeah, oh, bro. He said I miss. Bro, my- hey, hey. For I'm, mad, I'm, I'm mad at myself. No, 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 no. <laughs> Stu is the goat. You know why? This motherfucker will put a link up 15 minutes into a show. Like, everybody just come join. Everybody to come on and he'll just leave. <laughs> or or I'll let them take the show over. Bro, you'll just leave, bro. Like, it's like, where the fuck did Stu go? He fucking drive into the liquor store. Or some shit. <laughs> this motherfucker just gone, bro. <laughs> hey, I, I, I'm like, what the fuck, dog? Let me see. Shout out to Squid. He said, yep, Stu fucking leaves his own shows to join someone else's show. <laughs> Dude, one of the best. Stu would leave his channel and come do a show over here. Like, what's yeah. that, Yeah, yeah. Uh, dude, one of the best. I-, I was just, me and my wife were driving, coming back from Michigan, and I was just going through old shows just to see, like, what the fuck I was doing. Right. And there was a show. It was me, Dark Side, and I think Coach, you know, the Houston yeah. Texans. Yeah, yeah. It's my it's my channel, and they're like talking about Raiders, and all I'm doing in the background is just dancing to like Too Short and like Wiz Khalif, and literally for we and my wife watched it for about 45 minutes. I danced the whole time, and them two just had their own conversation about Raiders, and it was almost like if someone were to pull up, they'd be like, "This this is this is they like they this is a skit of theirs, like this is something they they do because it was dude, it was just fucking it was great because they completely ignored me." And I was coming up and like saying stuff and then backing off and they're just chopping up about the Raiders like in depth, like having a serious conversation. Hey, T, I've seen him leave and T run the show. I've seen Terrence actually be like, yeah, well, he's talking to somebody else. Well, uh, OG Raider, he he took over the show. OG? Yeah, OG. That was when I flipped over and went to your show. OG was on mine. What's what? up with OG, man? I haven't seen him in hell long. How's he doing? Last time I saw him, I was on I was on OG and uh, uh, Captain Show. Yeah, yeah, you guys did a show. It was like good. That. It was good. Ago. Yeah, it was a really good show. Shout yeah. out to North Carolina Raider Jesse. These are the tickets right here, you guys. If you have not gotten your tickets yet, hit that link. They're only ten dollars, y'all. You get to see a, two legends. I don't give a shit. I call my brother a legend. Stu is a legend. Oh, uh, uh, Warren Sapp, Hall of Famer. Too short, legend, corrupt, legend, B, legend, me, legend, Andy, legend, hammer, legend. Well, and then that night, and then that night, you're going to have Buster Rhymes, Ludacris, uh, Rick Ross. A bunch uh, of legends. Dibbit. Hey, I'm not going to lie, bro. Luda, Luda's going to, man, I ain't going to lie. I'm looking forward to meeting Luda. Now, now, yeah, now, see, I've been around Luda several times, and I'm going to tell you one thing about Luda. One of the best, coolest, mo- bro. That's good Luda, to know. That's good. I like when I hear that. Luda will see you guys and come up and give you a hug just because you. I like. Him. I like. I like hearing that about. Yeah. No. Right. Luda is solid as a rock, bro. Like, I used to write for some of his artists in Atlanta. And I used to go to the studio and I would see him in like certain clubs and shit. And I remember one time I was in in Dallas. I was at a strip club in like the, like years ago, and he walked up to me and he just tapped me on my back. I didn't even know he remembered me, and he just gave me a pat. That, that's that's a, that's a true that's professional. Dope. That's dope. That, that's, a, that's a true superstar. That's that's a humble guy who, yeah. um, you know, because there's other guys that fucking one. I know Ti is a fucking idiot. Oh, blah, blah, blah. I can tell you firsthand. I don't rock with Tip. Like, like, bro. Like, I used to work at one of his. Did clubs. you ever see his son's a fucking asshole too, oh, yeah, man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Golly. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's a, that's a whole different. Look, look, we can go to well, I got a whole show for that, Stu. We will leave that alone. But I'll tell you what. No, but that, that's what I'm excited to meet these guys and just right. Me too. Me you short, know. short, solid. Um, Rick Ross, very solid. And I heard I've never been around him. I, I was funny is I used to Buster Rhyme seems cool as shit. Oh, Buster, I've, I've always heard great things about him. Yeah. But what's funny is I used to work at the nightclubs. Remember, I used to work at the night with, with uh with, with Bro- o- Uche. With Uche. Uche, yeah. And, and every time short was, I mean, every time uh uh Rick Ross would come. He had this big ass Maybach. So I would do security and valet. And he would always give me the keys to park his shit. And I'd be nerve is as fuck. This big ass car. And I'm backing it into this small ass, little ass shit in front of the club. Bro, it was the most nerve wracking shit in the world. But he would always give me like a thousand dollars every time. Just to I like that. that. That's cool. You know I mean? That's cool. Solid individual. Don't get me wrong. I used to give half of it to Uche. Matter of fact, if Uche was here, I, I would be real. 
I ain't supposed to keep half of that shit, but Uchi, I used to keep half of that shit. Don't worry. There, there was yeah. other there was other nefarious things going on <laughs> other than just you keeping a couple of dollars out of your fucking. Oh, no, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, like when I hey, broke put my, up Rude Boy Julia. Like when I um, broke my foot oh, on Pac-Man yeah. Jones uh, 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 and them. I remember yeah. that shit. Shout out to Uche, man. You said, you said put up who's? Rude Boy Julie. Let me see. See, I'll, I I want to meet these guys because I don't give a fuck who you are. If they're an asshole, I'll fucking you know me. I'll fucking I'll make I'll make a fucking example of them. <laughs> Thanks, rude boy. I appreciate that. Because oh, you don't have, you don't have to act that way. Right. No, you know like you don't have you don't have to be like that. So, hey, 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 have y'all talked about? Are we gonna are we all getting the backstage passes for fucking for for the for the main event after our after our event out in the front? Let, let, let me just say this: B, sit your groupy ass down. And relax. Shut okay. your ass up, bro. Okay, relax. All right. Just 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 we'll just, we'll go talk to him. We'll 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 just, go just, see just, if you can just just go just go with the flow, bro. Hey, okay. we, hey, we'll be like, hey, listen, hey, listen, man. We got a friend. Hey, B, and, B uh, likes he wants all you guys autographs because when we were in Vegas yeah, last time, right. yeah, he's, right. hey, 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 he's, right. right. he's not all That's there. Not doing. Hey, 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 we were in Vegas last time. B said Charles Woodson's a regular person, he bleeds just like me. <laughs> Okay, that's not what I said. I said he's just a, he's just another dude. That's it. He and, might and, not and, be. Oh, like I'm not gonna still, put him on still, a but, like but when we still, left, when we left, he might not bleed like you though. For no, real, but no, but when we left, B said I, I fucked up. B was like, I fucked up. I wanted to meet Charles Woodson hella bad. <laughs> I go, I was, I should have sh went over there and met him and shit. But I was, hey, that's yeah. okay. That was the one dude that I was kind of like, because obviously growing up in Michigan, especially during his time in Michigan when I was just. Eighth grade, ninth grade, right. tenth grade, right. like Woodson was the f everything, dog. Yeah, so yeah, like yeah. when I was like, I'm, I mean, I, you know, obviously I'm, I had a chance to meet a lot of great players, but he was the one I was really like, just play like, don't play it smooth, like, be cool, like, just be cool, <laughs> like, let you know, like give him his props, but don't like get you know too too into right. it or whatever. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. But right. he was all, he was he was always yeah. cool shit. He's done events out in Napa and I think even in Sacramento with uh you you know DJ A to Z, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he's done he's done events in, out here in Napa with with one of my boys uh as a DJ for the Sacramento Kings out here. So uh And I like how Woodson's on social media too. Like he'll Yeah, he'll put right. up and he'll like he'll right. he like looks at it, you know what I'm saying? He'll respond to shit, which I think is right. pretty cool. I, I, right. I told you, bro, like when I met him and mind you, I know I I'm, that's one of my sponsors and shit, but like shout out to my boy Jay, shout shout out to yeah, all Yeah, hell yeah. But but bro, when when C Wood met me, bro, and he knew who I was and he was like you be hustling your ass, like bro, that meant a lot to me. Well, hell like, yeah. Damn, bro, like this is crazy to to be acknowledged. So, you, you know, know what? You know what's funny? Like you just how you said, like the president of the or the owner of the the Titans was watching, and Woodson like looks at the stuff. That's what I try to tell younger players. Like, dude, you gotta realize, like, there's a lot of people fucking like watching you. Don't fucking go out there if you're like in half ass shit. Because yeah. if if you ain't gonna give it your all, then don't do it. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, docs, if you're gonna do a show and you're not feeling it, just don't even do one. Yeah, you know what I mean, because yeah. like. You have people watching that you have no idea about that, like, hundred percent. You know what I'm saying? So is, like, essentially, this is like a guerrilla marketing platform. So we're, you know, we're put, pushing out so much content that, like, you know, over time, you know, with the algorithm and everything else, you never know who the fuck is going to be watching. You know what I mean? You, 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 you just never know. Yeah. No, that's that's why I always try to, like, I'll try to, I'll send a message to guy like content creators I like. I'm like. Not saying like I'm like, you know, I'm I, I'm Stuart, I'm with the Raiders, or you know, I used to play for the Raiders or whatever, and right. you know, I like your show. Just if they look at it or not, most of the time they don't, but it's always cool when they respond back. They're like, hey man, thanks, appreciate that. Right. Hey, see, like, that and that means a lot to those guys because you're a former Raider and you and, and you believe that shit. Some so. of these I'm I'm saying some of these dudes, they have mil like thousands of fucking followers and shit, but I'll still throw a message on the case maybe they do read it and I, the day, I, I, bro, we're, we're, all, we're all regular motherfuckers bro like you right. know what i mean like this there's right. no difference in this shit right so well, we, we know that but we also know that some people they think differently of themselves so i always just take it where i'm not gonna you know because they might be feeling themselves a little bit or right whatever, right you know right what I'm saying so egotistical shit right see, yeah, see, what, see what is the dude so like he went and took a bunch of pictures with everybody right and he had this section in the club. And remember, B, we, we had access to it. We could sit in that. Yeah. 
in the spot with him and shit. Yeah, I and remember. I remember, shout out to my boy, uh, my boy Murph and Swaggy. Uh, they were like, Swaggy. they were, they were like, can you get, can you get him to stand up and get a picture, man? We would love to get. We didn't get a chance to take one, mind you. See, Will was already done taking pictures, bro. Like he, at this point, he was ready to sit down, have his wine, and just enjoy the rest of his night and leave with his bag. You know what I'm saying? And I went up to see what I was drunk as fuck. And I'm like, what? I'm like, the homies want just one more picture, bro. Is it cool? Like, I'm going to be honest. If I wasn't slapped out, I wouldn't even ask them. You know what I'm saying? But I was right. like, see what? I'm like, bro. And he he looked at me. He was like, he looked at his people. was like, it's good, brother. It's all good. Like, let's, let's you know what I mean? Right. He stood up. He took the picture. He smiled. To be honest with you, it's one of the best pictures. I'm actually going to blow that bitch up and put it in the garage. I saw like, it. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, like, it's one of the best ones. And he looked like he was all in the picture, all happy and shit. Like, Right, that's right. the kind of yeah, shit. yeah. I, that was a badass picture. That was yeah, like that. That's when you. That's where you want to see your. I was idol. actually mad that when I saw that, I was like, "Damn, I want I, I would have. That would have been my moment. That would have been cool just to be in that picture. I'm, right. I, was, I was pissed. I missed that opportunity. That was. Right. Cool. I mean, that was a bad dude, I mean, fucking, you know, see what he follows you on on all the shit. I, like, well, it's, you know what I mean? I, reconnecting, you though, reconnecting, yeah, right. it's different. You know what well, I'm saying? Well, you know, I, I'm that bridge, and I'm definitely going to I'm gonna bridge that gap. I'll tell you that. Right. Um, shout out to my brother Squid, man, as always, bro. Kobe would always talk about how he played through pain a lot because of the fans. He never knew when it was someone's only time they could make a game. That's yeah. what I, yep. I, I did see that about Kobe. Yep. And it was, it was, it's Kobe's birthday today, too. So and I made, I made, oh, yeah. dude, happy birthday. Happy yeah. birthday to Kobe. Yeah, yeah. Happy happy birthday Kobe. You would have been 44 yeah. years old. Like, it's crazy. Like, like, Kobe was like my favorite athlete of all time. Like, yeah. I know. I've never I, listened to other athletes talk about Kobe. Oh, yeah. They're like, dude, the guy, they're like, I, I tried to like train with them and shit. Like, that dude was crazy. Yeah. Like, he, he literally, that was, you know who he, he that, Okay, think of Kobe. Drew Brees is the same. Was the same way, right? Like, just dedicated to his craft, right? Like I remember there'd be times after the game, like we're like, I'm like, hey, Drew, what's you know we're talking with? I'm talking with Brittany, his wife, and you know Philip, Sean or Sean Phillips, you know the defensive end, and Nick Hardwick, who are Purdue guys I graduated with, you know, and just talking to Chargers, and Drew comes out, and you know we're out there having a beer and shit, and Drew, hey, what's going on? How are things going? And he's Hey, Stu, you know, in the third quarter when you guys, it was like third and fifth, like third and 12 and you were playing cover two, why'd you come down on that tight end so low? And I'm like, I'm like, Drew, dude, like, like we, we get, we, we get like five hours from when that <laughs> game's done until like we get to the fucking facility, like where I don't have to think about shit. Like, right. I don't know, man. But like, that's the difference between the great greats and like, because I remember who was that? Was it? The door. Who was it? Was it maybe? Was that someone was talking about Kobe? I, th I who was it? I was I, I, another fucking great basketball player, and they're like, dude, like we we'd like want to go out and do like this stuff and like. And he all he wanted to do was go back to the court and fucking yes. work on his craft, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. fucking beautiful. Which I respect. Which is a true professional. It's but, like it's like that next. It's like that next level fucking dedication. But it, it, it's right? almost it's it's when I when I think about that, I think about well. When they don't have that, are they going to be able to, you know, right. like, are they going to be right. able to I, I, I feel like with, it? I, I feel like with Kobe, like, even though, you know, it was very short-lived, you know, given the unfortunate circumstance, you know, just body armor alone, right? Like, I think he invested like four or five million in the body armor right. and got like 400 million back for his estate, you know, after he passed. And, shit and like you know that. what? The, I'm not he even bought out by Pepsi and shit. So, and then, and then he got, I think he got like an Emmy or a, or an Oscar for like some short film that, that he had contributed to and shit like that. So I think that, you know, taking that competitiveness, you know, off that court and, and trying to translate it into real life scenarios, I think, you know, in the short time that he was alive after, you know, after he uh, retired that he was already starting to be successful. And take so that I, what I'd say, I mean, I know they can be successful, but is, is that really gonna keep him like? Is that is that gonna keep him fucking? Is that gonna scratch that itch that he had yeah. just go out there I, and, and, just fucking, and we'll never know now, right? You know what I mean? Like, I, I'm saying a lot of players. That's like, you know? like when I like like Breeze. No you know, ring, like, no bugger, y'all. Nose ring, no bugger. Probably. I'm just like, <clears throat> man, like take some time off. Like again, like like goddamn um uh Frank Gore, like bro, you played 17 years, like. And, and and are top three in rushing in the league in the all history. And, and, they like, got, and they got knocked, and they got knocked out by a boxer and got knocked out by a basketball player. Just sit down, dude. Just sit down and fucking yeah. right, right. 
relax for a, right. a couple months. Like you earned it, dog. Like right. that to me, that not like it took me a while to figure out how to actually like enjoy like what I'm doing now. And I fucking love my, 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 like what I, what I really don't do, like my little routines around the house and what right. I do with my kids. Right. But I know that feeling of not being satisfied. And that always hurts me with some of these guys because it's like, man, I, I know that feeling of not like, it's like they're still searching for something. And it's like, 100%, man, 100%. you're not going to find it. And usually what happens then is that leads to the depression and then that leads to alcohol or drug addiction. And then that right. leads to divorce. And then that leads to right. bankruptcy. And then that leads to death. Right. And it's right. unfortunate because I, that feeling of just think about, they were so six and I went through it where I'm just miserable with my life. And I'm thinking like, man, you've done so much and been so successful in, in, in different areas. And you're just, you're just, you're just mad about the shit you didn't get. You know what I'm saying? And it's like 100%. real quick. Uh, that's why when I met you and we had those conversations in Vegas, I was like, bro, like you should be proud of yourself in the sense of like, it's still, love- even when I hear that shit, like it's still like, yeah, I get it. I get it. I, I want to say real quick, you guys shout to realist Raider that was in the chat and um, shout to Liz Guzman. I just got two tickets to the game for the for the New England game on Friday. Um, just off based off the love. I appreciate you guys. I cannot say how much I have the greatest fucking support system in the world on the right. internet. The nation is different, man. Um, Liz and uh Realist Raider, if I can do anything for you guys, you know how we do over here. We we we, we gotta reciprocate. So let me know. Um, if you guys have a product that you guys sell, if you guys have anything like that, please let me know and let me try to help you run up a bag. Yeah, you know I mean, so um, shout to uh, you know, Realist Raider and uh, Liz Goose. Yeah, that's dope. That's dope. That's dope. That is dope. That is dope. Hey, cool, Kev Gore. W- Gore came in in 05, I think, didn't he? Or no? I don't, I don't remember. In? I thought it was before that. Was it 03? I thought it was. Hold on. I don't remember. I thought it was 1982. You're, you're right. I think him and OJ were in the same draft class. <laughs> He's 39, bro. He came into the league. I'm 41. I know, but he so he he came in. He was what, year, in 2005, year before, year 2005. Yeah, he's after me. He's after oh, me. 2005. Said he came in before and after me. So third, third rounder. Hey, guess what pick? Third. Where were you picked at, Stu? I was like the seventy sixth. So he was right before you. He was sixty five. I got a great game again on my on my YouTube channel in two thousand six. The cut up of San Francisco. I got I had a great game against Frank Gore. You tackled him a few times? A, a, a fucking bunch of times. Fucking one-on-one, dude. Like, fucking open field. That's Raider Rick. Tackles, hands this down. Is B, this is B right here. This is my little brother. So, um, just you um, talked about the poll. Now that I know you're going to be in that stadium, just – I got some stuff planned. Sorry, so, ass uh, bitch. So, B, 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 ass B, bitch. It's going to be It's going to be you and the – it's going to be you and the wife, right? No, you're coming with me, bro. So I, I, look, I'm gonna get now that now that I know you're gonna be there, I'm gonna get a separate a separate ticket. And we all gonna be in there together. Okay, so it's all good. All right, for sure. So, yeah, yeah. No, we're not doing talk that. About, we all, talk about I ain't got no pool, motherfucker. Watch. We gonna <laughs> see. Hey, Thor, Thor got the pool. You, you ain't got no pool. Hey, bro. shout out to Thor, man. In fact, I need to reach out to Thor, man. So be looking out for my call if, if you're. Well, we're we, we gonna be at his house on Friday anyway. Okay, for sure. Uh, we might we might have a, a one or two people pop in on this in a second real quick as well. Shout out to Gabe, man. Can't wait to see you, my brother. Hey, man, if y'all don't follow Raider Gabe, y'all please do that. I'm telling y'all right now, Gabe is one of the yeah, coolest motherfuckers hey, in hey, the world. I fuck with Gabe. I fuck with yeah, Gabe. Hey, hey, bro, hey, hey, Stu, when you meet Gabe, you're going to fucking love Gabe, bro. Like, Gabe is like... Send, soul, set, or send Cal. I mean, we, we, I didn't, we didn't want to talk about it. We know that. We don't, I don't, we don't know the whole story behind it, so, you know... Let's just give the man his props as far as football. I'm not talking about anything as far as what he does in his yeah, personal. Yeah, 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 yeah. We think how, I, I hear you though, but we, we gotta. We get it. Yeah, no, we get it. We get yeah, it. Yeah. Right. If that's true, out of gas, out of pocket. But like, we, we gotta pump the brakes and, and not jump out the window with certain shit. But I, but I, but I, we definitely know what happened, though, my brother. Um, shout the one legged pigeon. Um, this is actually card hard, my brother. It's not yellow. It's it's um like what, what, what's this color? Stool that that card hard shit. It's like a dirty well, green or some shit. It's um, Car is a sponsor of the NFL, though, right? Aren't they? Carhartt. I think they are a sponsor of the NFL. There's Carhartt oh. official license stuff. Um, 
Okay. Shit, I don't know. It, you'd uh, what would that what would that be called? Um, it's like the Carhartt's natural color. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Tan mustard. It looks kind of like a mustard. Yeah. Um, Timberland. I like that. Rude boy just said Timberland. Like it's like Timberland kind of. Fuck it. Color. Shot Thor said, "Ha ha, y'all leaving the house stumbling." No, you yeah. will be, motherfucker. I know that for sure. You'll be... I mean, bro, you're gonna no, be no, 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 bro. Thor, this motherfucker came up unbuttoned his pants and shit. What the fuck going Thor's on? Thor's going to be <laughs> no, bro, Thor, leave, bro. Thor naturally stumbles. Like, that's just a... That's a... That's a hey, great Thor, hey, Thor, it'd be 10 o'clock in the morning. Thor be already... He'd be already fucked up. I'm like, bro, how do you do this? He'd be like, I do this shit all day. Bro, bro. Hey, hey, you know what? It's, technic <laughs> hey, it's technically called Hamilton Brown. There you Hamilton go. Brown. What y'all talking about? The, the color of that Carhartt shit. The Carhartt, uh, like brown. That shit, that shit is that shit is dope. I ain't gonna lie, Bruh. The, the store I have two forty ounce Mickey's already at seven forty five in the morning. It'd be old, old English or something. Come on, catch up, motherfucker. <laughs> like, hey, I'll, show, I'll show you. I, I'm, I'm looking forward up. to sliding uh, a Thor, bro. I, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Again, that's called being a fucking professional. A lot of my interviews I did, like when I had my radio show, and when I did like the. Stu's views or like produce stuff. I probably had 24 beers before, you know what I'm saying? Fucking uh, maybe some other activities going on and fucking boom. Once the lights hit, baby, fucking, fucking you there wouldn't you go. fucking tell. Hey, dude, hey, we got to do, we got to do an old school radio show for just for old yeah. people, bro. Like we, like we already, cause me, me and Shilmore, we're already going to do um, a pod, a, a audio podcast. We need to do one of them too, bro. It's honestly, I'd like, I'd, I, I'd love to do that. I really would. Like, I was gonna say, you, uh, you, you guys are aware that you could take the audio from. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. No, and definitely. And that's, a lot of guys do. Yeah, a lot of like my. I want to do more pod, natural. I don't want to do that. I don't either. Um, I want it to be like, yeah. I want to. I want to get like on all the podcast networks and stuff like that. You know, like yeah, fucking, no, we can do that anyway. I, I can literally. Just download this afterwards off StreamYard and upload it to fucking that's Apple. That's what I'm saying. Oh, that's that's what I'm saying. I know, like, but... It's just another it's form of distribution. You know what but I mean? But it's, like, it's different, though. Like Different form of media is what you're saying. Audio, knowing it's just audio... Yeah, the energy's different. It's right. different. Yeah, yeah it's cool right. because you really... Because all you have... Is your voice. Yeah, that's voice and, and content. And your, and your intellect. Voice right. and content. You, yeah. All this, which people like, can sometimes... Uh, over overtake yeah, over, dumb over shit there. someone's over, saying, hundred percent. Yeah. Or sometimes just looking at somebody, you 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 form an opinion on them, and the information they're saying doesn't that necessarily match up, which it should. When people can't hear you or see you, they're they're trying to figure out what you look like and stuff, and they're really okay. listening to what you're saying. But video will always be like, in my opinion, video will always be king. I think I think that. Audio, there's like a certain niche, right? It's like it's it's a little different, you know what I mean? It's See, I, I that's what how I I don't watch TV anymore. I just sit down, turn all the lights off, and I listen to my podcasts. Right. Yo. What up? Yo. What up, hey, man? how did you move? How's the? Did, are you in? Fucking boom boom room in the welcome, back. Welcome, welcome to the vault. Nice. There you go. Hey, so Stu said, bring the championship belt. You about to get fucked up for it. <laughs> he says he's gonna DDT you. I'm taking that shit ASAP. <laughs> okay. ASAP Rocky. <laughs> What's good, Ham? What's popping, my brother? Hey, shit. I actually sitting here about to concoct a New York sour. Whoa, whoa, whoa. hey, yo, hey, hey a, a yo. New York oh. What? What? <laughs> What's a New York salary? <laughs> What's that? It's some Woodson whiskey. Dope. Hell yeah. Some lime juice. Hell yeah. Oops. Is that what they're talking about? Because he hit me up the other day. Some simple syrup and his intercept red wine. Oh, shit. So, okay. Do you, do you know all the measurements and shit then? Yeah. I'm going to just use one shot glass to make it. That sounds pretty hmm. good. That does sound good, actually. I think you mentioned that on the last live we went on. Hey, just the, hit me up. Shout, shout out to my Wilson Whiskey family. Kyle, appreciate you, bro. Yeah, we definitely had fun doing that presser today. That shit was dragged out a lot longer, but we were able to cover everything. And we're going to – I just pushed back the live. We're going to do the fantasy rankings in 40 minutes. 
Hammer. Oh, yeah. Hey, hey, when are we doing the, the, the whole fantasy football league shit? I know we were supposed to go live and fucking do a draft and all that. When, when, when are we doing that, guys? I'm going to be honest, bro. Like, the way my schedule is looking and way with everything, I'm nervous, bro. Like, even Samoan just hit me up and said, bro, you're going you to rejoin the – it's me, him. There's another one that I was in last year. Bro, I don't know if I have the fucking time, bro. Like, I just got so much shit going what, on, what, bro. What is – what is what do you, what, what do you have? I might, I might want to join football. Fantasy football. Don't get me wrong. I love that shit, but it's like I, I just love the camaraderie. Talking know, what's shit. the league? What's the league? What's the league? So, uh, we, wanted do, we wanted to do a, a shield more one with all of us. You know what I'm saying? And then, um, and then Samoan has another one, a Raider Nation one with me, him, Scout, uh, a bunch of other, a Sanjeet, and uh, everybody in that shit. But that's how much I mean, is it? How much is it to join? What was it last year? I think we just. I think we just did. No, I think it was fifty. I think we did okay. fifty. Yeah. And then the winner, the winner, the winner got the same belt that Hammer got pretty much with the Raiders shit on it. The winner shit. And um and, and like yeah, I, I might like, wanna I might wanna jump in maybe. Not to self-invite, but since I didn't get invited by any of you sorry ass motherfuckers, I'm gonna invite myself. <laughs> hey, don't feel too bad. I, I barely just got invited this year. All right. Yeah, so don't, don't feel so that angry. Bad. Bro, I fucking thought that I sent this shit to the group. You're not even in the fucking groups, dude. You got fucking you asking people for money on Instagram and shit. I don't know what fucking shit is real, bro. What, what? the fuck is going on? What? <laughs> God damn, bro. I don't know what the fuck. Like, what the fuck is going on, bro? Shit. Hey, just... t- dude, t- I got four kids, bro. Fucking <laughs> I- shit. I mean, what the fuck, dude? Andy, what up, brother? Yo, <laughs> you was good. Good. Fuck that, fuck that weak ass hat. Little bro, what up? Ooh. You wearing the Astros hat? I, I don't trash. know what the fuck this team is, but I'm wearing it short. <laughs> that shit is uh, ass. This team's probably fire. That's why he's hating on it. Fucking ass, bro. What's popping, bro? They won a couple years ago, I think. None much, bro. Yeah, they you know, cheated, bro. Setting up, setting up for this film. Verlander. Stadium. Verlander. For those who don't know, Hammer did a live earlier, which was a great live. Is that a Black That's Panther it. shirt? You're wearing, what is that shirt? It's a Raider shirt. Oh, let me see. Oh, those are just okay. Those are just necklaces. Yeah, Andy, Andy got a. Andy has a fire <laughs> film. Uh, a film study. He's about to drop you guys on Jonathan Abram. So stay tuned for that. Right yeah. after this, you guys, he will be dropping a haymaker on you guys. Eight minutes, Eight boys. Eight minutes. Raiders football talk, you guys. Make sure you guys support our little brother, man. And he is going to be in LA with us this weekend too, man. Most definitely. <laughs> what, what's the video? Sorry, I missed that. What is it? So Jonathan Abram, his game against the Dolphins. He was, oh, you, he was, he's a strong safety, so he was playing a lot of that big nickel, and I think that's that's his perfect home right there. That's the match made in heaven. Yeah, Stu, he looked great in that game, bro. You got to go back and look at the tape. He looked fire, bro. Dude, it you put your players in positions for them to be great, dude. And Matter he, of fact, he, Stu, he's I'll been send playing you the fucking link. You could you could be up there with me. Yeah, he's been playing out of position his whole career. If right. you want, you could pull up. We could do it together. Still, that that. Oh, are you doing? When are you doing it? Five minutes, eight minutes, whatever the fuck. Okay, I'll, I'll definitely pull up. Yeah, I'm Do getting. That, that would be fire. Guys, anyways, shout out to Omar. Yeah, a speedy recovery uh, for homie, bro. Shout shout out to bruh. Shout out to Omar too. Appreciate you on the. Uh, hey, on hammer. Yo. That light is that like one of those lights that goes off of sound? No. It's is it? It's just uh. Where's where is the where is the where are the lights the the color lights coming from? The behind behind the the logo. No, there's one above. I have the light above me. And it just it just goes through it. It's not, it doesn't have any like hmm. it's controlled by my phone and it has oh, a whole bunch of different oh, options. Yeah, yeah, we shit. talked about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Oh, hey no Stu, specs, which one is the non hacked account? <laughs> what are you what are you sending it to? Instagram? Hey, yeah, which which is the non hacked account? No, no, no. Hey, send it to Twitter. Are you on Twitter? Send it to his Insta, to his DM on Twitter. Okay, Andy, that, right. that's where that's where he always gets the live streams. Okay, what's your Twitter, Stu? Um, shit, what's y'all motherfuckers following each other on there, bro? You know I barely started doing this whole Twitter shit. Yes, man, this motherfucker uh, Andy. Andy thought he was just gonna kill the YouTube game without social media. <laughs> it is, yeah, <laughs> you. <laughs> It's, um, fucking Instagram, bro. I don't want to do the Twitter shit, bro. It's at <laughs> thy butcher nine t h y b u t c h e r nine. Yo, shout out to Raider Rick for calling in earlier too. Much appreciated, bro. 
he said in the comments, has all kinds of gadgets except the cooler. Yeah, that'll be next. What's the cooler? Some crazy ass cooler he was talking about during the live. He's like, I should get it. And he's like, You got an outlet right behind you. You should get one. I'm like, Okay. <laughs> or just shit don't even feel right. right without fucking wasted, bro. This shit's terrible. I fucking so miss him, bro. <laughs> he caught COVID, bro? Yeah. Yeah. Damn, dog. He good right now, though. He's straight. The other day, he had me a little spooked, though. I'm going to be real with you, but he good. Like, well, that, I mean, he's, he's, he, he goes out and he gets around people and shit. So he, yeah. 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 Somebody at his job actually. There he goes, too. Had it. Senate? I got two people right now. I got two people on my job that got that shit, and apparently oh, one of them was sitting in the office, no mask on for a whole eight hours, got mandated, <laughs> and found out that they got COVID. Well, I heard the other thing. The uh, what's what's the other the pox the what's that other shit? Monkey pox, bro. I heard that shit is. I bad. saw that shit firsthand the other night. That shit is fucked up, bro. What do you I mean? Bad. What so, is it? Like, what, what, so what? they were like, I, I was inside and one of the nurses was like, yo, can you come open these doors? Like, we got to put this dude in an isolation room. I said, all right, I got you. I turned and saw the dude. Oh, my. Yo, his whole fucking face. These fucking like blistering pussy fucking spots all over his fucking face. And they didn't even know for sure yet. But then, like, I spoke to the doctor and she was like, out there oh. looking like he was out there looking like Justin Herbert and shit. Pretty much <laughs> ten times worse. Oh, that's fucked up. And then they were like, uh, they're, they're like one of the secretaries is like, "Yo, come check this out." So the dude is on a floor now, and they showed me like the full. I was like, I saw this dude like two, three nights ago. I I knew he had that shit. This shit is no joke, y'all. Shout out to Watts, <laughs> I, bro. You gotta send me that. I gotta see this. Yeah, no What's shit. Up? Who the fuck he is this? He fuck? said, "Fuck Paul Gutierrez." Bruh said in an article that the chemistry between Carr and Adams is overblown. He, he also said, said he also said the Klee was getting released. Fuck yeah. Paul Gutierrez, bro. Didn't learn a thing from being a coach. Oh, before. he's that fuck face that that uh that Carr put in his place. That Carr shitted yeah, on. Dude's a fucking, so this funny. guy's a fucking idiot. He's a clown. Let's give him the clown boots. Fucking <laughs> yeah. Ronald McDonald. That's some oh, weird man. shit, bro. Fucking hamburglar. I feel like somebody. I feel like somebody in the Raiders organization fucked Paul Mom or something. Like, <laughs> like, like somebody knocked his mom shit down. Like for real, bro. Like something happened. Like, or if it hasn't happened, someone needs to. Yeah. Hey, like, have, have you guys watched that new uh, pivot? That pivot episode with Devontae? Yeah, that shit it. is good. That shit I, is good. I heard Snippet. what he had to say. That shit yeah. was. Oh my god, man. Yeah. That shit was fire. I didn't see it. Yeah, he's talking that shit, man. I love it. Yep. He definitely is. I seen a few snippets where he was like, "Look, like our receiving core pretty much is fucking crazy. Like, if you ain't going to me, Hunter, Hunter got it. If you don't go to him, Waller's gonna score." And he was yep. basically, he was just, he was really talking that that boss shit. Like Devontae yeah. was also like, like yeah, he's a, he seems like a pretty fucking cool dude. Yeah. Pick I mean, your poison, I mean, he's, he's been he's hands down the best receiver in the league the last yeah. couple of years. I mean, it's between him and what D Hop. D Hop was injured last year, like. Nobody's D Hop. D Hop is on a decline. <laughs> well, yeah, but I'm just saying, like, who can you? You know what's funny? They made up. They made up for that bitch ass shit they said about Hunter Renfro the other day, and then the whole Waller uh, situation. Who, who said some uh, uh, Renfro? The the pivot. They basically oh, Ryan, pivot guys. Besides, uh, besides um, Ryan Clark. Ryan the Clark, the running back. Uh, besides, bro, Channing Crowder is the only one that doesn't dick suck, bro. Yeah. He's the only one. Yep. He, he be keeping it real. He keep it funky over there. I don't Bro. know, dude. He's but I'm going to be honest, though. They have, an, they have an entertaining show, though. I promise yeah. you that. It's entertaining. Well, they have credibility. They play in the league. But I'm going to go uh, no, who, set up. Okay. About Who's the running back I'm thinking of? God damn it. Uh, Tomorrow, oh, you're talking about um, um, uh, McCoy. Shady no, McCoy. no, 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 no. The Jacksonville running back, the Hall of Famer, the fucking oh, Fred Jackson, Fred Taylor, Fred Taylor. Oh, Fred that, Fred he's Taylor. the only one. He's the only one that fucking. I I I respect him on <laughs> the other. The other guys are fucking. I don't know, dude. They're Yo, fucking, highlight EJ shit. <laughs> Hold on, real quick. Ninety six is Docs. Marcus did already. Mister Allen strikes again. Without the clock, work two. Finally caught alive. Respect nation. Shout to my dog. Now you said put who up? EJ. What they say about Renfro? I said Fred Jackson, bro. What the fuck is going on? Um, you said EJ? Yeah, EJ Raider. 
He's, I don't pay see. him or find out where Paul lives oh, and I'll ship him a CWA shirt. What's CWA? The shirt that I just put out, Car with Attitude, and it has him telling Gutierrez to, he doesn't like his tone, he better pump that back a bit. <laughs> I, hope we've already I, just, I, just know, I just know that video of him when he fucking, after they lost to Cincinnati, he came on there talking about they're going to make the playoffs. That shit was fire. Yo, one of, those, one of those reporters today said some um, asked like fucking Max a, a personal question about like, yo, what if the time comes on a Sunday that your wife is gonna have the kid? Like, what are you gonna do? Like, the fuck is it your business, he's bro? He's gonna do. He's gonna go fucking work. He's gonna go to yeah, the- yeah. Well, he's not. I'm not gonna do anything. I'm gonna finish the game and then go well, see hey, your wife. Yo, like the people who were in that, the like, chat were like, got a hundred million dollar contract. What is he going to do? Well, that doesn't matter, guys. Shit, we saw guys miss fucking games before. Like, I guess people can come and fucking go. It's not work, I guess. Guys aren't contractually obligated to be at this fucking thing, apparently. Bro. Listen, bro. He Max is. I, I, I'm going to go dip on Andy saying I'll be back in 10 minutes. I thought he was just dropping a video. No, I think he's going to go over that Abrams deal. I think right? it's pre recorded, bro. Well, then what does he want? Why do you send me a link? A link to what? Hey, Stu, real quick before you get out of here, right? Did you see this? Did you see my Paul Gutierrez skit? I do not play it. I don't play think it, I- bro. Play it real quick. Play it. I got to see this shit. It's the Paul Gutierrez skit right here. Shit is hitting nicely. All right. You see it? Yeah. Wait, he didn't okay. see it. Me and you tonight. Movie. Dinner. The boys are at the uncle house. We're shaking. Whoa, 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 whoa. Pump your brakes and wash your time. Happy birthday, son. Nine years old today, baby boy. What you trying to do today? Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Bro, my family is really tweaking right now. Like, they really took that deer whoa, car press. Whoa, 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 whoa. Pump the brakes, man. Watch your tone, homie. You got yourself? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. That shit was no, fucking I can't with you. Stu's out of here. I know he's going over there. <laughs> oh shit. That, that shit was funny. funny. I can't now, hey, real Stu's quick though. Here. I know he's going over there. Oh shit. Oh, that shit was funny. I can't. What the, the, hell? the fuck was all that? The live was oh, it, it came back on on YouTube. Uh yeah. Um, everybody, we're not going to do that. We're going to go over to, to Andy's channel, man. Everybody go support. I'm on an hour and a half. I, I want to go see my sons for a few minutes before I got to dip out in the morning. Um, B, my brother, I appreciate you, bro. Man, uh, always, Kevin, always a pleasure. Brother, you already know. B, I'm going to see you tomorrow. Yeah. I'm going to see you Friday. Um, Nation, I'll be in California tomorrow. Be in Vegas Thursday and Friday. Hit me up if you guys want to rock. I don't know when the next time I can go live, so... But Friday Vegas. night when you come to the house, there you go. Because the shit's gonna be set up and we gonna we gonna act out a little bit. There you go. Uh, we Raiders, go crazy football talk, you guys. Go over there, support our brother right now. Him and Stu about to break down some film. I don't want to miss that. Love y'all nation. We outro one. <laughs>